up next, Bulletin Report. FBS News and Current Affairs. Maasahan, hindi lang sa salita, subok na sa gawa. For the headlines. Rains brought by Typhoon Lando, which caused enormous floods in Kalumpit, Bulacan, is still rising non-stop. We'll report it to you live regarding this situation. Farmers are lamenting due to the damage caused by Typhoon Lando to their crops. The supply of rice is also affected by the typhoon. The Department of Health is closely monitoring flooded areas due to the possible outbreak of leptospirosis. The Comunic wants to declare the majority of those who file their candidacy as noisance candidates. Celebrity dancer Jong Hilario takes a leap into politics, vows to bring fresh perspectives in genuine change. And dogs with extraordinary talents featured in our good vibes. From the FBS News Center, the Philippines' leading news program, this is Bulletin Report with Kentaro Susero, Kai Joseph, and Gabriel Ansaldo. Good evening, folks. It is Wednesday night. I'm Kai Joseph. Kentaro Susero is on vacation. I'm Sofia Penelope Joseph. And the big stories tonight on Bulletin Report is all about Typhoon Lando. Parts of Bulacan and Pampanga, which are natural catch basins for flood waters coming from central and northern zones mountainous areas, are now submerged after Typhoon Lando's torrential rains. Water levels have reached the rooftops of some houses, leaving residents stranded. Gabriel Ansaldo has this story live regarding this situation. Gabriel? Kai Sophie, a total of 301 families, so 1,137 individuals have been placed on the preemptive evacuation and already been given assistance by the Department of Social Welfare and Development here due to continuous heavy rains and strong winds. As of tonight, evacuation centers are now being monitored by the DSWD in Villa Vichosa Abra, Corner Apayao, Tabuk City, Kalinga, and in Bakunin, Benguet. Meanwhile, a fisherman has gone missing in Abra to the strong rains and flash flooding. The missing fisherman was identified as Ryan Tiglai, 24 years old, who got swept by the current